Hey, what's up, y'all? How y'all doing? What is me till I saw? Yeah, it's me again. I'm back. You know what? I'm happy. Hold on for me. Let me fix my camera a little bit. My bad, y'all. But it just didn't look so right. It still don't look right. Everything. Yeah, I, I, I guess that doesn't have to do. But you know what? Happy New Year's, y'all. Yeah, I said Happy New Year's. For, you know, it's, it's, it's just been s something on my mind to do that I, that I just gotta get off my mind, you know? And what it is is this. Y'all remember back in the days, I told y'all that I'm gonna start getting the Bible and reading. I wanna read the whole side of the thing. And and that way it'll give me something to talk about to y'all too. At the same time, tell y'all and that's what I'm doing. You know what? And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to put it into today, today's life. And then speaking of that, while I'm thinking while I'm talking, y'all y'all Y'all, y'all should also know why I tell y'all over and over. A lot of them need to start reading about for itself. Cause you got so many, so many people being slick out there and trying to reword the words to make it mean what they want to make, what they want it to mean. You know, like for example, it's funny, but it ain't funny. It's, it's a preacher. You know. You know, I'm, I'm very honest and very blunt, you know, and I tell pretty much exactly what's on, what's on my mind, you know, you know what I said, cause this preacher, he asked me, he said, why do I, why do I, why do I jack, why do I play myself, and I like, it helped me leave myself, it, you know, so I won't have, I won't go and buy none. I won't go out and buy none. Yeah. Cause I buy some, I be paying for something I can't get rid of. So that's why. And I ain't got no shame in nothing I do. Cause I'm ashamed that I should never do it, right? Right. <laughs> but anyway. Well, so he told me, he said, it's in the Bible. Look in the Bible. Well God said he'll He'd rather come in the in, in come in the bed of a hole and then waste his semen like that. You you wrong for that. You need to stop doing that. And I said, I said, is, is this right? That's why I asked him. That's the way I said. It's you know, it's in the Bible. You know, and I asked, that's the way I want I want to read it. Cause y'all know I'm the type of person. I don't just take nobody's word for something. I want to see it. You know. Then if you can show it to me, then I can. Then I stop. You know, or I do my best to stop. You know. So I said, I told him, so I told him, show me. He said, just look in the Bible. You find it. So I looked. I looked for it. I looked for it, but I couldn't find it. You know, I look for it. I, I, so, it just hit me. Not long ago, I found it. What was talking about? You know, what I found it, I looked on the computer and found it. <laughs> yeah, I cheated a little bit. And, isn't what he didn't tell me, it was, it was in Genesis. That was Old Testament. That's the Old Testament. And then, it was, it been reworded. You know, for the fit. Fit exactly what he was trying to tell me. It wouldn't, that wouldn't, what it, what it actually was. You know? Y'all know what? I'm, I'm, I'm gonna read it to y'all too. Yeah, that's what we're gonna talk about. So, y'all see, I got my Bible, my whole Bible. And I'm gonna read Genesis chapter 38. Because this way is it. And it's all of it. Um, about this time, Judah left home and moved to Adam, where he visited a man named Hugh, 
there he met a covenant woman, the daughter of, she was the daughter of Shu, and he married her. She became pregnant and had a son, and Judah named the boy Ur. Ur. That's his name, Ur. Y'all look, y'all see, I tell y'all, I showed y'all what each name mean also. I posted on my, my profile. But, Ur. Then Judah's wife had another son, and she, she named him Olin. Olin. And when she was born a third son, she named him Shula. Shula. At the time Shula birthed, they were living at Kizzle. When his oldest son, Earl, grew up, Judah arranged, arranged his marriage to a young woman named Tamar. Because y'all y'all know back in the day, they just, the husband used to arrange everything. And it don't go like it, go, it goes on there nowadays. Well, we find our own wife. No, they, they, they arranged it. You know? But anyway. But. He married to a, he arranged for him to marry tomorrow. But Earl was a wicked man in the Lord's sight. He he wasn't that good. He was man. You don't say what he did, but he wasn't good at all. So the Lord took his life. I mean, he just killed him. Then Judah said to Earl, brother of Odin. You sh you must marry tomorrow. I mean, she just going. They just passing down the line, but they, that was their belief that back in them days. You know, you you must marry tomorrow, as our law requires of the brother of a man who ha has died. Her first son from you would be your brother here. You know, what it's saying is this. What the first very first child she had is really his brother's, not not his. You know. But old 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 man was not willing to have, have a child who would not be his own her. You know, he couldn't he couldn't see that. He couldn't see see him getting someone pregnant for his brother. It's I mean it's he feel he felt like I did all the work. That's my that's my child. I ain't gonna follow that rule. So, but Olin was not willing to have a child who would not be his own. So whenever he had intercourse with tomorrow, he spilled this cement on the ground. He wouldn't come inside, you know. So that. That way he he made sure he he didn't get up pregnant. He was sick with and everything. I mean, oh, that's he was slick. He just slept with him, but he wouldn't he wouldn't wouldn't get her pregnant. That what she wanted. But so whenever he had in the cold tomorrow, he spilled the semen on the ground to keep her from having a baby who would. Belonged to his brother, but Lord considered it as be a weak, a weak, a weak, weak, weak thing, weak thing. Only did not deny to ha to have a child to his dead brother. So Lord took on his life too. I mean, my, my father just killed him because he he wouldn't he wouldn't get a pregnant for for his brother. That's, that's crucial, you know. But hey, that, that was that was the, that was the root back then, then, them days, you know. And Ju then Judah told Tamar his daughter, daughter-in-law, not to marry again at the, at the time, but to return home to her parents' home. She was to remain a widow until his youngest son. Sherlock was old enough to marry her, but Judah didn't really intend to do this 
because he was he was afraid Shula would also die like his two brother did. You know that made a lot of sense. You know he the first very first one he died because he was wicked. And then Una died because he couldn't he couldn't bear him getting getting pregnant and he can he couldn't say that was his his child. You know. So, so they yeah one more one more child to give him. But he was scared to give that child to him cause my father is killed two his two of his sons already. He only got one child left. So he got scared. Nah, I ain't gonna do that. I don't know, I ain't gonna I ain't gonna get sure to have two of my sons killed. I ain't gonna have no more. My child killed. You know, that's what he's thought. So, wait a minute. Oh. Um, so, tomorrow, she went home. Like, yes, to She went home. And of course, the time Judah's wife died. Now, Judah's wife did. So, Judah's alone now, too. So tomorrow was aware that she, Sheila had grown up, but they, the other, the other son grown now. He him, he got old enough to handle his business now. So had grown, they had, but they didn't call him, call her to come and marry him. I mean, she sat away for for them to call, but they ain't never call him. They ain't never call her. I mean. <laughs> She was, she was about 38. She was hot. She was mad. But. So she changed out. She changed out of widow clothes. You know. She put on a disguise. Covered, and covered herself with a veil. Disguising herself. Then she sat by side road. In entrance to the village of Enema. Which is the way to Tamal. Judah noticed her. You know, here she was sitting outside. Ain't can nobody don't know who know who she is. She was she just disguising herself. Oh yeah, my time is almost up. But I'm 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 feeling speed up a little bit, all right? But Judah noticed her and he went by her. Noticed her, and he went and thought she was she was just a prostitute. Since her face was was veal, I mean that's how she disguises looking like a pro a pro, prostitute, looking like something that she ain't. But hey, back then then they mm, no my y'all, I'm gonna keep that coming to myself. But so he stopped and pros. Prophesized to her, sleep with him. You know, you all know what I'm trying to say. He he asked her to sleep with him, look like that. Not would not realizing that she was his own daughter-in-law. He didn't know that was his son's wife. It's both his sons that she had she had cute. Well, she had him cute, but they died because of her. You know, so then she, she then she asked me how much you gonna pay me. She asked me how much you gonna pay her if she let him sleep with her. Then he said he said I seen a, a young goat from my flock and you were promised. What what pledge you to give? What pledge will you give me so I can be sure you will send it? She asked. I mean, she like, how I know you ain't, you ain't, you gonna keep your word? How I know that? I don't know that. So he said, well, what, what do you want? He in, inquired. So she said, she replied, I want your identification, seal, your cord, and the walking stick you are, you are carrying. So Judah gave these items to her. She didn't let him sleep with her. I mean, 
Uwe fell asleep with her, and she became pregnant. So he did the deed. He got her pregnant, but he 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 didn't know that was that was so he got pregnant. You know, I'm gonna start right there because time's getting getting rid of getting away from me. Everything, and I don't know how much time I got exactly. But I'm, I'm just go back. I'm just go with what I what I already read to y'all. What is to me? This is my own opinion. opinion. He a woman. Her first husband, Ur. My father killed him because he was evil. You know, though Ur means also y'all evil. And so my, my father just got rid of him. But the law. Back then, back then, back then days, she, 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 she couldn't mess with nobody else, cause she was married. Only way she, only person she can marry, mess with is a, his brother, his brother. So, so he, so the brother came along, and he, the brother slept with him, but he wouldn't get her pregnant. He kept putting, pulling, pulling out. I mean. She was good enough for him to see what she might well, he might well go ahead and do the deed then. But he didn't do it. So my father got mad at him for not doing it. And killed him. That was his punishment. You know? And yeah. Y'all know what? My time's up. So I promise I'll be right back. Cause this is getting good, y'all. Alright? Y'all bless so much, y'all. Peace.